Have you ever wondered why women can be so fucking difficult? You pour your heart and soul into her, and yet she's still distant and cold to you. You know what? Before Shogun Method, most of us have been to where you are right now. You're busting your ass trying to make her happy, bending over backward to do everything right, but she still thinks it's not enough. Here's the thing. She doesn't want all that shit you're doing for her. Deep down, she's craving something else, something primal to her psyche that's embedded inside her animalistic reptilian brain. Today, we're going to dig into her mind and unravel the enigma of female submission to masculine dominance. Spoiler alert, women are hardwired in their female psyche to submit to dominant men. She secretly wants you to dominate her. Some soy boys find this shocking, but fuck them. As a Shogun Method practitioner, you need to accept this truth if you ever want to have power over your relationships. Let's get real. Society has brainwashed you into thinking, being a nice guy is the way to go. Guess what? It's not. Women don't want a doormat. They want a man who commands respect. Behind that smile, she's yearning for a man who takes charge, a man who can lead. But here's the catch. She'll never, ever admit it outright. She'll give you that politically correct crap about equality and partnership. But deep down, her biological programming is screaming for dominance. She's fighting against her own desires, and that's why she's unhappy. Have you ever seen how a woman lights up when a man takes charge? Women crave male leadership like a moth drawn to a flame. Stop trying to be her best mate. You don't want her to see you as nice and easy to talk to. Talking is for women and children. You want to be the man who gets shit done. So, why does a woman feel the need to submit to a man? To answer, we'll dig deep into how the female psyche works. As you will learn in Shogun Method, men and women are wired to want different things. For men, our needs are more visceral and physical. Of course, we want emotional connection with our women, but men's sexual desire always starts from physical attraction. I mean, it's almost impossible for most guys to get a hard-on with a land whale with hairy armpits and B.O., unless you've got a fetish for that. But women are different. They are wired for emotional fulfillment. Of course, they still get horny for Chad Thundercock, but their sexual needs often come from a deeper place. Some women view sex as an exchange for security. Security that comes from knowing their man can protect them. The psychology behind this isn't complicated, it's instinctual. It's that primal desire for protection and leadership that has turned into their biological imperative. Let me share a story. There's this woman, Cherry, who was dating a Mr. Nice Guy. He is a decent, polite man, but he's soft like a pussy. And guess what? She was miserable as fuck. She wanted him to lead to be her master who steers the ship, but he was too busy trying to be nice. Then, Cherry met a Shogun and started banging him. I know this because the Shogun told me how he felt sorry for the nice guy. The worst thing is that the nice guy called the Shogun, cried like a bitch and begged him to stop fucking his girlfriend. Poor guy got laughed at, and he finally texted our brother Shogun. Okay, at least use a condom please. That's when the Shogun's conscience kicked in. So, here's the lesson. Why did a woman like Cherry choose to cuck the nice guy with a shogun? The truth is, Cherry didn't consciously choose who to bang and to friend zone. She only acted on her biological imperative that directed her subconsciously to the man who has a stronger masculine frame, the shogun. What's a strong masculine frame? It's hard to describe because overused words like confidence and decisiveness don't do it justice. But I want you to imagine this. You walk into a room, chatters stop and heads turn people feel your presence. You've got that swagger, that aura of power. That's your strong masculine frame in action. You're the man who knows what he wants and isn't afraid to take it. Your needs come above everyone else's. It's not about being a jerk. It's about being secure in who you are, the master and commander of your own life. When you establish this frame, you provide her with the security she desperately craves. Women want to feel safe with you, and a strong masculine frame does just that. It tells her subconsciously, I've got this, you can relax. And when she relaxes, that's when she submits. Remember, it's not about being controlling, it's about being in control. You don't need to dictate every aspect of her life, 
you just need to guide her and make sure she doesn't stray from the right path. So, here's the question for you. How do you establish a strong masculine frame? Well, if you ask a relationship guru, he'll tell you to simply be confident or be decisive. We all know it's not that easy. It's like asking someone to be strong. A man doesn't become strong just because he fucking thinks he is. Unlike useless relationship guru fluff, Shogun Method is about pure practicality. Real men gain confidence through results. We don't get confident chanting affirmations while doing yoga. That's why shoguns rely on mind hacks to bring our women to heal. And with that success comes confidence, control, and assuredness needed to establish a strong masculine frame. As I teach my brother shoguns at shogunmethod.net, our approach isn't in-out like those gurus preach. Instead, we take the out-in approach. Results drive confidence, not the other way around. Let me give you an example. Every shogun should know about fractionation, a staple shogun method tactic that alternates a woman between emotional highs and lows. It's a powerful mind control hack that creates an addictive emotional bond to a man in the woman's mind. Shoguns put fractionation into action by creating adrenaline spikes, either through an activity or conversation. After a peak, he creates moments of emotional distance, building intrigue and keeps her wanting more. In short, it's an emotional roller coaster. So, how does an emotional roller coaster lead to female submission? Remember, when a woman is on a roller coaster, she's no longer in control. She's strap in and she doesn't know what's coming up, and this builds anxiety and excitement. When you fractionate her, it's the same thing that plays in her mind. She's no longer in control, and she trusts that you'll lead her through the emotional ups and downs. The more excited she gets, the more she submits to you. And the more she submits to you, the stronger your frame gets. This is what I mean by the out-in approach of Shogun Method. Get the results and use the confidence to build a stronger masculine frame. Here's what I want you to take away from all this. Women want a man who takes charge. Female submission to male dominance is natural. Despite what social norms say, it's true. Women are wired for emotional fulfillment because of their biological imperative. A man who has a strong masculine frame attracts women automatically because it appeals to the primal instinct in the female psyche. How do men get a strong masculine frame? This is where Shogun Method's out-in approach shines. To unlock female submission, fraction at her, create highs and lows, and make her addicted to the emotional roller coaster. And when the addiction kicks in, she'll naturally fall into your frame. You can do this using Shogun Method's IRA model. It's a four-step process leading to emotional enslavement as the end game. By now, you've learned about the power of creating an emotional roller coaster that taps into a woman's subconscious desire for dominance. But here's the thing. We're just scratching the surface about how far you can go with fractionation. Inside the Shogun Method Online Masterclass, you'll discover a more elaborate and advanced version of this emotional roller coaster. It's the key to creating a bond so strong that it becomes unbreakable between you and your woman. In the Shogun Method Online Masterclass, you'll learn how to apply these principles step by step to become the dominant man women crave. Grab this opportunity to unlock your full potential and transform your relationships. To access the masterclass, head over to fractionation.org and sign up. Take control of your relationship and learn how to master emotional dominance through fractionation. See you at the Shogun Method online masterclass. Go to fractionation.org directly or click the link in the description below this video.